question that's been popping up since the overturning of Roe versus Wade. Can you get birth control pills in the U.S. without a prescription? Ariana Detell with our National Verify team has your answer. Since the 1960s, millions of Americans have used hormone-based pills to prevent pregnancy, making daily contraceptive pills one of the most common forms of birth control in the country, according to the CDC. But can you get them over the counter? After the Supreme Court overturned Roe v. Wade, an increasing number of people are searching for the answer online, according to Google search data. So let's verify. Our sources are the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, the U.S. Food and Drug Administration, and HRA Pharma. Over-the-counter daily birth control pills are not currently available in the United States. The FDA sets the effectiveness and safety standards for OTC medications and determines if a medicine requires a prescription. Daily hormone-based birth control pills have always required a prescription in the U.S., usually so healthcare providers can screen for conditions that raise the risk of rare but dangerous blood clots. So we can verify, no, an over-the-counter daily birth control pill is not currently available in the U.S. But that could change. On July 11th, pharmaceutical company HRA Pharma submitted an application to the FDA so that Opil, a daily birth control pill with a hormone called progestin, can be offered over the counter. If approved, it would become the first daily birth control pill available in the U.S. without a prescription, bringing the U.S. in line with more than 100 other countries that currently do this. What is available over the counter without a prescription is the morning after emergency contraceptive pill also known as Plan B. Unlike other birth control pills, Plan B is a single dose pill meant to be taken after sexual activity. With your Verify, I'm Ariande Till. Well, if you have a question you'd like verified, we can always find the answer for you. Just email us at verify at whas11.com or message us on Facebook and Twitter.